How's it going there, guys? Welcome back to the Weeb Lounge. I am Nick, and in this Princess Connect character spotlight, we are looking at Time Travel Kaya. I'm a little late on this one, but it's one of those characters where you really, really hope they're good, because everything on paper looks really deadly. Yeah, this character, when she came out, I was like, okay, it's Kaya. It's a character that I definitely like. Odd costume for Kaya, but it works. It's fine. And she has a bunch of skills. It's like, okay, this character could do some serious single target damage. Really serious. The question is, does she? Let's go ahead and get into the skills. Skill number one, Dragon's Edge, a single target physical damage attack. Yep, that's it. Nothing else to it. Real simple. I kind of like those. Easy to read. It's fine. Skill number two, Accelerator Reactor. Okay, skill number one might have been super simple. This one, not so much. All right, it increases her physical attack power. It will also increase her action speed, if not already under the effect. And the action speed boost is huge. It's really big. Okay. If under the action speed effect already, though, instead of refreshing the action speed, it will give herself a technique point boost which is, you know, a fairly decent amount. So, in other words, it's basically trying to speed her up and charge her up. That's what that skill is doing. Speed, charge, speed, charge, speed, charge. And you'd think over time this would just be ridiculously good skill. Not sure that it is just yet. EX skill increases her physical attack power, if you couldn't have guessed. Five star greatly increases physical attack power. No big th deal there. Union Burst, the Dragon's End Burst. It is a large single target physical damage attack that also increases your action speed to the absolute maximum allowed. I don't know what the max is. This is the first character I've ever seen that was like, hey, it goes to max. Okay, I guess. It'll also charge your technique point gauge by like a real minuscule amount. It, that, that's not important. So basically, big single target attack and ridiculous action speed, maxed out. She's speedy. Okay, she's super speedy, whatever. That all sounds like ridiculously, ridiculously good. Now, no six star, obviously, no unique equipment yet. Let's see what she can do. Will this look impressive or not? I don't know. I really don't. And I'm sitting here far farming Aoi shards that I really don't think I need at this point, but we're going to do it anyways. Now, Kaya, I took to 202, but her rank is still kind of low, so I have to try to find her wherever the heck she's hiding at. There we go. Yeah, I haven't been able to rank her up because there's so many new characters that I've gotten recently. I just, there's just not, I don't have the ability to do this. Okay, she's basically on the field. She's punching crap. Got her technique uh, charged up. Let's see what she does. I like that. Multi, multi, multi hit. Now her attack speed is like as fast as it gets. She's already ready to do another one. Considering her low rank... And no other buffs or anything? That's not bad. But I'm really kind of curious if this is really going to fly. Okay, here's the deal. Th this character is rated an A-ranked character, which means as average as it gets. That really, really sucks. But here's the downside to her. That attack speed buff that she has, it really, really lets her just keep building and building and building and building and going faster, harder, stronger, whatever the thing is with whatever. Okay. She can potentially do really good, but here's the thing, like, a lot of times when you're forming up a group, you bring in, oh, I don't know, a buff for action speed, okay? Now, action speed behaves different from attack power and defense. Attack power, defense, uh, buffs and debuffs, they stack. Attack speed does not stack. It never stacks. It just gets re replaced by whatever is cast most recent. So if you bring her in your group, and let's say Summer Siren. You throw her in there and it's all this attack speed stuff. Well, anytime Summer Siren does her attack speed thing, it'll overwrite hers. And hers is the best pretty much there is. So if you bring Time Travel Kaya here along, you can't really boost anyone else's speed 
at least nothing that's AOE, right? Which every, all the ones I can think of are AOE, so that's kind of bad. Okay, so that's kind of a downfall. Because, you know, you chances are you're going to have more than just this character doing attacks and everything, but they can't benefit from any speed buffs, so you kind of have to focus the group on her. Now you have her, you throw in like, you know, Labby or some other characters with just straight buffs, nothing with attack speed. You could make her do some absolutely serious damage, but unfortunately, when you're trying to compose another proper group, she kind of has to be the center po point. And unfortunately, again, she doesn't have the overall attack power and skills to really, really annihilate something that another character, a six star or something, can't do better. Oh, like, share, subscribe, hit that notification button, guys. Here's the thing, though. Now, if they give her some pretty decent, unique equipment later on, slap that on, it really depends what it does, and that could make up for this character's flaws. Like, maybe the attack speed buff cannot be removed or something like that, or cannot be replaced, or maybe just a more physical attack, more crit or something, more actual damage. She needs that little bit of reoccurring buff, besides the crazy uh, action speed stuff that she does, to really shine. So if she gets a unique equipment, I can see her going from being yeah, your average tier to really, really putting on some hurt. How much? How long? Whatever. We don't know. But it's if she does get any unique equipment, it's actually pretty far off. So if you happen to get this character, it's not a bad idea to prep her so that later on when unique equipment does come out, you can get it taken care of. But otherwise, as it stands right now, it's a character you can pass on. We'll see you in the next video.